Hey guys! Hey guys! Diana and Lily here from Garden Love. Yeah. Today we are going to talk to you about starting to prepare your um, fruit trees for spring and summer, right? Yeah. And we're gonna use this warm poop. Yes. We're gonna be using warm poop and also some fish poop. Fish. <laughs> we're gonna be and we're gonna be digging into this. Yes. So um, it's been raining for the last few days, like crazy, and that's the reason why I want to start fertilizing my trees, and also because it's mid-February, well, like February 10th. I already took this. Yeah. And um, so I'm gonna start fertilizing my trees. As you guys know, most of my trees are in containers. And you, if you guys have been following me for a long time, you guys know that I feed my trees <laughs> once a month. Um, and I feed them different things. So sometimes I'll do warm cassies, other times I'll do fertilizer, uh, fish fertilizer, other times I'll do like Ivy Organic or EB Stone Citrus and Palm um, fertilizer. And I'll just switch it up every month. That way the tree is getting something new every month and it's not being deficient of any source of my vitamins so and minerals. we're gonna be using these. We have our tools ready, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I because do. Um, we do need some tools to help remove some of the mulch, the top layer of mulch, so we can get some of the warm casting inside the soil, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the reason why I decided to do this is because we are going to continue to get some rain in the upcoming weeks. Um, some of the trees are already waking up, they're getting new leaves new blooms so they're waking up from the winter and they're gonna need uh, some light feedings light feeding would be like warm castings and fish fertilizer that's very organic and light i won't get into the heavier fertilizers until maybe march um, and the reason why i want to start feeding is because it's been raining so much and as you guys know that when these con these trees when they're in containers they are limited to what they have inside their containers and if they're constantly getting water every um all the fertilizer that's sitting in there it's pretty much being drained from the pot so therefore it's leaving my trees without anything to feed on um, and it's been raining so much that i definitely want to get an early start um this spring so that's what i'm going to be doing this is going to be the first feeding of the season uh, I chose to do um, some warm casting and some fish fertilizer. I'm just going to shake this up very, very well. It's going to probably be stinky in my courtyard for the next day or so because this stuff doesn't smell the best. And I'm running low, so this spring I'm definitely going to have to buy a new bottle of this. A little bit goes a long way, so I usually just put just a tad bit in my... There you go. That much. Lily, can you get the water? The the hose? My tiny helper here is going to help me today. Right? We're excited to be out in the garden because it's been raining. Lily, has it been raining a lot? Yeah? Do you like the rain? Yeah. <laughs> I can just smell it. You can smell it? What does it smell like? It smells <laughs> disgusting. It smells disgusting. <laughs> it smells disgusting. <laughs> it's been raining so much that I moved my bench over here because there's a little protection here and it doesn't get as wet as it would where it normally sits. So, what I'm going to do now that this is full... Mommy, when I do that, when I do that. Okay. Mommy, that's enough. That's enough? Okay. All right, guys, that's enough. I'm going to move you guys over here so you guys can see what we're going to do. Yeah, I'm just going to carry this. Two. It's too heavy. We're going to start with this one to show you guys. I'm just going to put Yeah, it it's down. heavy, so careful. So the first thing we're going to do is, we, I already started. I moved a little bit of the mulch out of the way. No way to take target thingy and routine. Yeah, go ahead and grab your tool. Okay, and you're going to use those ones okay. because I'm going to use these ones. Okay, and I'm going to grab some warm castings and just kind of like yeah, lay I'm gonna use all these around. Ones. Go under the mulch. Oh, I'm, I'm going to stick it with this. Okay. 
And once you get it in there, just put the mulch back on. Make sure that you don't cover the trunk because you don't want to get like root rod or trunk rod. And once you've done that, add your fertilizer. And I'm going to do this to all my trees. And this is going to be the first feeding of the year, 2019. Get them started, get them ready. And it's going to be, I feel like it's going to be a Why really good growing season. Because we've had Why plenty. Sure. Put it in here. Perfect. Now cover it with the mulch. This is the mulch. There we go. Good job. Your hands might be a little stinky now because of the fish fertilizer. Yeah. <laughs> and now let me try. Let me show you guys how pretty all the new growth that's coming out. This is my pink variegated Eureka lemon. This is the tree that I air layer my labor my neighbor's tree it's doing fantastic this is going to be the third year that i've had it there is some signs of flowering which is fantastic i don't know if you guys can see it here let me get you guys closer i want it there's a flower right there and i am just going to do that to all my trees in this case i'm gonna have to remove some of these rocks so I can get the warm castings in there and so we can give it a light feeding. Mommy, I'm doing something today. So I just wanted to share this with you guys because I want to I want to um, show you guys what I do to keep my fruit trees or in my citrus trees that are growing in containers going. And this is what I do guys. I feed them. Since it's the yeah. beginning of the... Do you have something to say, Lily? Yeah. I think my Lily's mom, taking over the show today. My mom likes a lot of plants, so that's why she buys them all. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> she just always likes to water her plants. Mm -hmm. That's what she likes to do. Uh-huh. What else? What do you like? Why do you like the plants? So, in what we're gonna do today, we're gonna be digging plants and we're gonna be putting the diet poop in. Uh huh. But do you like it that I grow plants? Well, do you like when you can come outside and grab an apple from the tree? Yeah, my mom likes apple tree trees, which likes you like like them. Uh -huh. So, it's fun having fruit trees that you can grab a snack from. Do you yeah. like that? Yeah. Yeah. And the other time we did, um, we picked some, um, okay, let's add the um, warm castings. Then I made all of this loose. Yeah, I'm doing something. Okay, get some with your shovel. There you go. So go ahead, bring some over here. Okay, there you go. Okay. So we're gonna be putting Good. some more in. Yes, and we're gonna be mixing it in, right? Yeah. And we're gonna have to try not to spill it because it's worth a lot. It's like yeah, because I already peeled some. <laughs> you did spill some. Here, let me help you. Yeah, so which, which we're going to do? <laughs> so now that I got a little bit in there, I got it mixed in, I loosened up the soil. Oh, oh this is making me getting tired. Yeah, you're yeah. Now. yeah, so this last time with my shovel, but it's not that good. No. Okay, that's the last scoop. Doesn't eat that much, okay? Yeah. And we mix it in with the soil. Yeah, but and now that it's mixed in, now time to add the fish poop. The fish poop? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Ma mommy, um, can I put some? Can I? Can I add some? Sure, you want to do some? Here. It's a little heavy. 
Yeah. You gotta use your tinker muscles. <laughs> there you go. I don't have tinker muscles. You don't? No. Okay. That's good enough. Yeah. Good job. And now? So that's basically it, guys. Uh, so you guys know I have tons and tons of containers to go feed. I wanted just to share with you guys what I'm doing to prepare my fruit Mom, can trees we do another one next? for um, the spring and uh, the first feeding of the season. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope this was helpful, and I'll see you guys in the I next one. Bye. I see it warm. Bye. I see it warm. You see it warm? Yeah. yeah. There he is. It's wiggling, huh? That's a good sign. It's wiggling like you were wiggling in it when we were having breakfast. Huh? Do you want to show them the warm? <gasps> There's a couple warm. That's a very good sign. Yeah. We got that warm in my mom's plants, which makes the plants grow some more. Yeah, so my mom just helps. But, um, but they also live in the dirt. Mm -hmm. Makes them come alive to you. They, mm -hmm. But they also dig out from it mm -hmm. because they can't stay out much longer no matter what. Yeah, so they live in the in the pots. And what do they do? They're eating in there and they're pooping in there so they're giving us free warm castings. Huh? I, I know. I know. I know. Yeah. Oh wow, perfect. All right, guys. Have a good day. Have a good day. So, bye. <laughs> Let's turn it off. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, leave it in the comments down below. Yeah. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Okay. Bye. Talk. So... Get in, get in. Okay, she's making a video. Hold on. Mm -hmm. So today it's me and my mom. Uh huh. And we're gonna be using this bum for digging. Uh huh. What is that? You say it. It's warm castings. Yeah. Which means it's warm poop, huh? Mm -hmm. And we're gonna be adding it to our plants. Yeah, and we got these here, uh -huh. which we're going to use. Your tools? Yeah. Okay. Why are we doing this? To feed the trees? No, to dig some plants. Yes, but this helps the plants and it feeds them, right? Yeah. Okay. Look at this one. All right.